So hi guys, welcome ulit sa ating panibagong video tutorial at ngayon sasagutan natin itong problem related sa projectile motion na topic. So yung problem, a ball is thrown from A. So ito daw yung bola natin. So inihagis daw siya from point A and then if it is required to clear the wall at B, meaning kung yung bola daw is lalagpas sa B which has a height of 8 feet from the ground, determine the minimum magnitude of its initial velocity. So, yung initial velocity natin of the ball is may angle na 30 degrees from the horizontal. And then, yung ball natin is 3 feet above the natural ground. Okay? And yung distance ng point A sa point B natin is 12 feet. So, may answer time na 40 feet per second yung initial velocity ng A. So, paano natin to isusolve? So, standby lang kayo guys kasi madali lang to isolve. So, first, kailangan muna natin isulat yung given. So, ito yung ating given guys. So, dito, dalawa yung i-consider natin. From horizontal and vertical. Okay? So, from horizontal motion, yung initial position nya along x is 0. So, dito nag-start yung ating bola. So, this is our x-axis and this is our y-axis. So, pag horizontal, ito yung initial position nya. So, 0. And then, yung final position ng bola natin is 12 feet. Okay? And then, yung initial velocity ng ating bola along x is yung x component nitong velocity. Okay? So, v cosine 30. And then, sa acceleration, since horizontal yung motion niya, there is no resisting force. Or consider na frictionless yung air natin, walang acceleration na nagaganap. So, constant siya which is 0 feet per second squared. Next is considered vertical. So, pag inahagis mo yung bola, yung bola natin is aangat. So, first, yung initial position niya along y is 3 feet. Kasi hindi, hindi siya 0 kasi yung starting position niya along y is given, which is 3 feet above the ground. Next is yung final position ng bola is 8 feet. And then, yung initial velocity along y is yung y component ng ating velocity, which is v sine 30. And then, yung acceleration natin is negative 32.2 feet per second squared. So, equivalent din ito sa 9.81 meter per second squared. Kasi yung unit natin is naka feet per second. So, kailangan natin i-convert yung 9.8 meter per second to feet per second. So, Ito na yung mga given natin and let's proceed to solution. So, by using this kinematic equation, isa substitute natin lahat ng given from horizontal. So, take note, yung isa yung given ng vertical sa horizontal nating equation. So, x natin is 12 is equal to initial position which is 0 plus 1 half. Yung acceleration natin is 0 d squared plus initial velocity natin na v cosine 30 and then yung t natin which is unknown therefore t next step dito is to simplify so we have 12 is equals to v cosine 30 multiplied by t so let's divide both side by cosine 30 para maging t na lang yung matitira therefore 12 over v cosine 30 so kung isimplify nyo to 12 divided by cosine 30 makukuha natin itong sagot so then kailangan natin i-note ito na equation 1 since dalawa yung ano so let's proceed to vertical equation so substitute natin to we have 8 feet equals 3 and a half
be sine 30 multiplied by 13.856 over me. travel ng bola, substitute lang natin yung velocity dito sa ating equation. So, ganun lang mag-solve guys ng project motion and hope na nakatulong. Thank you guys and God bless.